Welcome to a volleyball day in my life. What's up you guys? So today is Sunday and I actually have pretty much a full day of volleyball ahead of me and I decided that I wanted to take you guys on what a day in the life of a volleyball player is. I don't know. It's always different depending on what's happening. Some days I just have practice. On weekends I could either have games or tournaments but today is a special day because it's my last time playing at home at SJSU for the women's club volleyball team. Technically our senior night uh, because this is my final season. Obviously I'm graduating in this May. So I thought this would be a fun one to document because we have two matches today and we're also taking like photos beforehand, headshots and a team photo and all that. So I'm gonna have to get ready in just a bit, but yeah, it's gonna be exciting, it's gonna be fun. I am on the club team, so I'm not on the school team, which is like up here in terms of competition level, practices, training, all that. Club volleyball is like right underneath, still high level volleyball. We practice twice a week, like I said. It's been such a great option for me in college because it still allows me to balance other things like being a sorority or doing YouTube. I'll talk to you guys more while I'm getting ready, but I'm gonna go make some breakfast, something light and healthy to start off my day. I don't wanna be too full or bloated, so let's go to the kitchen. I'm gonna make some oatmeal today. Put it in the bowl, add some hot water. Actually, yeah, I'm just gonna heat it up. Usually I would make coffee in the morning, but today I don't know why, I'm just in the mood for tea. So hot water and then this is from Target, it's peach honey. Love adding peanut butter to my oatmeal because I freaking love peanut butter. And it's also just a good source of protein. Honestly, I couldn't tell you. I'll look it up and I'll let you guys know. Bananas are great for when I'm playing or working out, whatever, because you don't want to cramp up, get some potassium in there. And so, there's breakfast. I know it doesn't look too cute, but it's healthy, light, and great before a game. Mm. Oh, wow. Banana is really sweet. Normally, I would never eat a banana that's that brown but in oatmeal or smoothies or whatever. It's great because it just adds a lot of flavor. I know oatmeal can be pretty bland for some people. That's why I add some stuff to it. Getting ready right now, I'm putting on makeup, which I know, why are you playing volleyball and makeup? Well, today we're taking photos, so you know, I'm gonna look presentable. Also, it's my senior night, so why not? I'm probably gonna sweat it all off, honestly, which is really gross um, and probably not good for my skin at all, but you know, you look good, you feel good. Everyone is entitled to do, wear whatever they want. I mean, obviously you have to wear the uniform and stuff, but like makeup, however they want to do their hair. All right, let's just set all this and hope to God that it can last a couple of games. While I'm here getting ready, I guess I could talk to you guys a little bit more about club volleyball in general because I feel like I get a lot of questions about it from people like, who are interested in playing and don't know if they should do it or not. And I would say that I definitely recommend it to people who have played on their high school team and also if you've played club volleyball, so like volleyball year round, growing up, whatever. I will say that it is competitive. So if you're looking for something that's more like fun and just whatever easygoing recreational volleyball, definitely in murals. That's good if you don't have a whole lot of experience playing. If you've played on competitive teams before, definitely club volleyball. It's not a huge time commitment, and if you love playing the sport, it's honestly so awesome because you get to continue playing in college, which for a lot of people, that's not a thing because people will grow up playing a sport, and then by the time college comes around, if they're not on the school team or they just choose not to play on the club team, then that's it. If you've been watching my videos for all of my college 
life and you know that like I really love playing on the club team and met so many amazing girls through there some of my best friends we get to travel on weekends when we're in season it does get to be a little bit busy like literally every weekend for February and March I have something going on but it's it's all fun and I love the sport so it's worth it to me. Our senior night is pretty early on in the season this year, but it's because these are our only home games. We still have a lot of this season left. This isn't like my last game ever, just my last home game. We're going up to Davis one weekend, we're going to Sonoma, we're going to Anaheim for a tournament in March, and then, um, what else? What's the big one? What's the other big one? Oh, Nationals. We're going to Kansas City this year, which is really exciting. I haven't been there. I've heard some great things. Minus the fact that Kansas City beat the 49ers, but it's fine, you know, it's okay. For those future weekends of volleyball, I'm gonna try to film another one of these sort of day in my life, weekend in my life type of videos because the one that I did last year did really well and I guess people are interested in seeing what it's like. So be on the lookout for that. Perfect. Alrighty, we're ready. I gotta get changed, pack my volleyball bag, and I'll show you guys what I bring with me. I gotta get out of my comfy PJs, unfortunately. Ta-da! Usually always wear my warm-up. Black spandex, Nike, of course. Whenever it's like a game day or tournament day, I always make sure to wear my nicest socks because I've got some like crusty old Nike socks, but then I have nicer newer pairs or like my stance socks but I couldn't find those, so we're going with these. Enjoy it. This is my volleyball bag. This is from my freshman year, so I'm actually not number 11 anymore. We got new jerseys last year, so now I'm number seven, and I've been number seven since, I wanna say, I think starting like my sophomore year of high school. I don't know, I just really like the number seven. I always just keep my shoes in here. These are the Jordan Why Nots. Um, I don't remember what number they are, but they're the high tops, or no, low tops. I've had these ones for almost like a whole year now, and it's really weird because usually I get new shoes every season, which is kind of excessive, but like literally haven't found a better volleyball shoe, or like I haven't really tried any other volleyball shoes since I've gotten these because I like these so much. I think the support is really great, and I don't know, they're just sleek like you can't see the laces in the front which I really like I've just been sticking with these um, they're a little bit dirty but it's whatever I already have a pair of shorts in here probably from a while back but I just like to throw these on after I finish playing got some crusty knee pads in here which I will be swapping out for this fresh pair they're still old but at least they're clean can't forget the jerseys We've got three different ones. Um, we have a black one, a blue one, and a white one. Since it's a home game, we're obviously gonna be wearing white, but we have to bring all three, just in case something happens. Like if someone has bloody nose, you have to stain on the jersey, we just all switch out. I don't think I've ever played where we had to switch out due to some reason like that. I've definitely done like, oh, switch out jerseys halfway through the day if we're all really sweaty, but you know, just gotta be safe, pack them all. We got these last year and they're so, for rush, we love, love the Nike. And then, got my hydro, obviously gonna fill that up downstairs. And then I'm gonna bring my hyper bowl too, because this thing saves, because uh, this thing saves lives. I should honestly use this way more, but I'm just lazy sometimes. It's quite an investment, but it's worth it because as athletes, we gotta take care of our bodies, especially considering like how much we work out and we train and we practice all that if you've never seen one of these contraptions it's just a massage gun it's called hypervolt um and i got this like a couple years ago you just turn it on flip the switch and it goes so fast oh, i love using it for my shoulders yeah last night it was super tight so i did use this thank god and on the hamstrings oh a volleyball day in my life so welcome to my life <laughs> we're getting ready to take photos everyone looks all done up our number one fan hello is it focused oh there it goes all right we got pictures going right now prezi <laughs> you gotta go like this <laughs> shout out to emily's dad for doing this for us so professional hell yeah Work it. This is YUH. This is where we're playing today. Last year we used to practice here. 
but unfortunately, no more. There's Cam, Coach Cam. Whoa! Oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, everyone. Hey, ladies. Stop it. Get 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 it. <laughs> Those are good. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Oh gosh, my shoelace is untied. All right. So we just took team photos, and we have a little bit of extra time. But our teammates told us that we need to go on a walk. We got Sharon and we're come through. We're graduating this year, so it's our senior day, and we have four years with you, bro. Four. I know we go way back, oh. but we started off with five freshmen, and then now we only have three, well, two, two, and then two original guys over last year. We got our transfer right here. Yay! Hell yeah! Hell yeah. Um, but they told us to go on a walk for some reason to I leave the gym. Why. Mm -hmm. I, I have no idea what's why. happening. But we have no idea what to expect. But anyways, we're at Phil's right now. We're getting coffee for ourselves and other people. So we can get pumped for this game. Woo! Oh my god, stop. Look at her tail. Oh my god, she's got a long ass tail. Hi! Thank you. Mm, it's good. Thank you. Thank you. We have a game today, so. Thank you. Oh my god, oh my god. Ah, yum. Medium. What did I get? Filtered soul. We're supposed to go back now. Eee, I'm so excited. Run away, won't you, baby? Dinner only, you got to be. Swap on day with your shoes. There it goes. One more time. Sorry. Ding. Yay. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing? Like, right. Back here? Yeah, or that's fine. <laughs> Yay. Oh. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. Dude. These are so nice. Oh. Damn. I love. Wow. I love this. <laughs> who, who did that? Who did that to me? <laughs> no! We did the posters are so nice, Kira. <laughs> She's back. <laughs> I'm so happy. Wow. For real or like no, another one? Like,
right, so we just won our first game. Paloma, this is Paloma. We literally met. We've met twice before. At the mall. At the mall, this twice. Yeah. And she came to my game. I, I literally, I'm crying. And she made me a poster. Look how cute. <laughs> okay, we're gonna take a picture. Volleyball day in the life. Oh. Hi, I'm Moni. Hi. Hi. <laughs> my grandma's here. Gosh, it's on you. Yes, my mom is there. Trying. A fan made me this. A fan came to watch me. Really? Yeah. You're a fan? Yeah. Oh my God. Wow, that's very nice. Taggy <laughs> Fanny, Fanny, let's go. Should I try and get a girlfriend? Tell, tell, tell me where to go. Can I eat her? <laughs> yeah, Chris! I got that! Oh my god. Yeah, Chris! I got it! You're like, step up the content, bro. There you go, baby! Hey, vlog. So, we're at your senior night right now for hey, Chris. Vlog. Hey, vlog. Hey, Chris. <laughs> hey, Chris. This is in your vlog, though. But in honor of you um, not we're just watching we're you. you. Um, yeah. I believe you're you're number seven. You're over on the other side. We actually can't yeah, really gonna, see you. We're gonna send you some footage of you playing, so then um, you can input it, it and in show your, video. your fans because I want to see it because I'm your fan. Happy senior so, night. So like, subscribe to Chris Huey. Such an amazing day. I'm literally in a loss for words. I had the best day. The amount of support today was unreal. My parents, my grandma came out, my sorority sisters, my roommate, and just so many other friends. I'm I can't believe that was my last time playing there. Um, we did win both of our matches, and I don't think I filmed. I didn't film any of the second game. We tried to film the first match, but I think people's butts got in the way and sorry if it's really windy. I'm gonna go home now, drop off all this stuff. I'm kind of struggling out here, but look at these amazing posters. I can't wait. Honestly, these are probably the nicest posters I've ever received and I've been playing since like middle school. Even this one, gotta love it. Go number seven, Chris. <laughs> this has got to be a safety hazard. I cannot see through the back window. Oh, and there was literally a cop that just drove by me, so. Hopefully I don't get pulled over. Oh my god, that was so fun. That was such a fun day. It's like five o'clock now, I'm heading home. I'm gonna shower and just settle in. I actually have some work to do tonight, so. That pretty much concludes this day of volleyball. I'm so happy that I documented it. Oh my gosh, is there parking? There we go. All right, I'm pulling in now. All right, you guys, so that is going to conclude this video. I hope you enjoyed this volleyball day in my life again it always varies you know depending on what our volleyball schedule is but i wanted to show you guys what this particular day was like because it was really special to me really appreciative of all my friends family who came out but anyways if you guys enjoyed this video please be sure to give it a big thumbs up subscribe if you're not already that is it for this video i will see you guys in the next one